Oh, Whitey Femi Fems. It's a great day, honey buns. Take your love vitamin. Let's take a look at what you need to know. Divine Feminine Holy Spirit. What do they need to know? Divine Feminine. What do they need to know? Holy Spirit. Ooh. After the rain. So it's it's no more raining. I heard the sun is coming out. Things are getting better. Um, definitely, definitely some of you all need to know that you don't need to be grieving over a situation or a circumstance. Something is over. Just accept it. And this this could also be someone needing to accept that it's over with you. I just hear it's over. It's just no more brand new cycle now rose without thorns you have a right to your joy peace sweetness of life this is where your life is going to get sweeter and sweeter i feel like you all have put up the right boundaries and you're blocking the right people out you're protecting your energy you're protecting your peace also because i heard new moon and um full moon people work on you a lot during the moon energies that stuff is not going to phase you, not like it used to. You may have a little insomnia, be a little, you know, edgy at times, but it's not going to be long lasting. That cycle of all that heavy manipulation with um spells and witchcraft, it's over. Yep, the reunion, a soul recognition, collaboration, partnership, or friendship. Some of you all are going to be connecting with a friend. It could be, a, I heard, a long-lost friend. It could also be someone that, that you meet that has a very Kendrick-like energy, and your soul will recognize that person. Those of you all that are into, like, partnership, building um alliances with people, be prepared because this is going to be something that's going to be mutually beneficial. Now, here is here it is, your blossoming. That's what it is. You're growing. It's time for you to celebrate right time to harvest so there this, this is your season this is your season of favor and breakthrough is what i just heard ancient power expression activation your soul is very bold your soul is very recognizable your soul is very woke also stop allowing your mind to take you back the spirit knows more than what the, the mind does. So don't allow yourself to always keep going down memory lane of hurt and pain. They hurt me. They deceive me. The Holy Spirit is saying, honey, that's over. This is after the rain. You may still love. I, is that better right? I still love you after the rain. The rain is gone. It's over. You still can love that person. If, if No matter if it's a romantic relationship, family, friend, associate, but your your life is never going to be the same. This is a breakthrough of pre peace, a breakthrough of promise, a breakthrough of prosperity. This is a breakthrough of, ab of abundance. You're just not stuck anymore. So don't allow your mind where the battlefield is to keep taking you back. And this is where some of you all need to excel. You know, maybe it's time for you to make a choice about someone that you used to want to be with and have a connection with someone that you can truly um, really connect with. All right, Holy Spirit. You know, some of y'all have a lot of like envy and hate around you. And the reason why is because you're getting this breakthrough and you're not broken down. Holy Spirit. Some of y'all, y'all have some people I always want to see you like sad, down, and depressed. What do the divine feminine need to know, Holy Spirit? Yep. See right here? The nine of cups. Your wishes are coming true. Your wish, I hear your wish is my command. God is saying, what do you want? Somebody right here is in regrets because you're moving on. I feel like some of you all, you've just, you just changed. This new energy, it's a new you. You've manifested a new you, your prayers, you're seeing them, you know, manifest right before your eyes, materialize. You know, what you thought wasn't going to be with your life, God is showing you, oh no, I promise you peace. I promise you a peace of mind. It wasn't always meant to be this rub. I just needed you to move and get out of the way. Some of you all, you actually were in the way of God. And now God is saying, I'm giving you your heart's desire, whatever you want. Your wish is my command. I do hear the words reconciliation. So for some of you all here, there may, there may be a reconciliation with someone that you knew, someone that you know, someone that, you know, a relationship you could have thought or a friendship you thought was over. God is saying, no, I'm going to change that around. I've changed you. I've changed them. 
after the rain. You still love them after the rain. I'm going to place that song down there below. It helped give some of you all more of, um, more insight. But I'm, I keep hearing breakthrough. This is your time of breakthrough and favor. What you're reaping is what you deserve. Yep, the moon card. Nah, yeah. A lot, a lot of people have moon energy. Um, they, they Excuse me. Uh, people messing with you during the moon. The full moon and the new moon. Be mindful of people wanting to talk to you during those times. Get close to you because they're trying. Yeah, you. So Y'all got magicians. And that's what these people don't like. The people that used to manipulate you can't and these are energy vampires that don't even affect you anymore but yet, yet still they're persistent because they're stubborn that's that's just a part of being ignorant that's their thing it is what it is what holy what the holy spirit is saying to you you recognize these sneaky people you recognize these thieves these thieves are out of your life keep them out don't let your mind go don't let your mind go back i keep hearing don't wander back now, some of y'all here, you may have moved on, like, physically, and you've been thinking about going back to something. It could be some sort of, uh, I actually heard addiction. Don't go back. Don't be tempted back. Because people can see your breakthrough. People can see you, you're moving on. And that's the thing. People can't get connected to you and your energy the way they used to. Holy Spirit, what else do the divine feminine need to know? This is a straightforward message. This lets you know you've passed a test that God approves. All these devils, the devils, <laughs> you know that saying, the wolf in sheep's clothing. You see them for who they are. These players that think they're going to connect with you, it's just a no-go. You're not playing around. You're on a different journey. You're in it for the good time of life and the long time of you having longevity of peace and happiness. Anyone that's going to come in your life and be in and out thinking that you are their one-time good time, it's just a no. You have goodness upon your life right now. Don't mess it up. Some people are obsessed with you. This, that's what it looked like. And some of you all, just so you know, this is an ex that works on you with this moon magic a lot, trying to keep you stuck, trying to get you back to a certain place. Um, and this could be this person that wants to reconnect with you also. This is, I definitely see an ex. Mm -hmm. See, you have tread on the devil. You made the devil cry. Whoever this devil was in your life, you brought this person to tears because your energy is different. It's all about you speaking up for yourself. It's all about you not saying saying one thing and then doing another. You are a doer of your own words. You know how people say talk is cheap? That's not who you are. You're not a talk about it. You're a be about it. But you didn't make this little devil here cry. And that's good. But this person is still trying to um, connect to you energetically. How you want to close this out with the Divine Feminine Holy Spirit? Divine Feminine. Yep. There are, there are a lot of things. I actually hear there are a lot of people that think about you and think about what you're doing. You are on a lot of people's mind. You're leveling up. Some people don't like it. Some people have regrets about not being, you know, true to you when they had you. And now it's like this. They want to offer you what they could have of some of them, what they should have before. But you fall in so much in love with yourself. Your life speaks for itself. You don't need anyone to validate you. And this is the thing. People that took your love for granted. It seems like some of you all have a lot of people Family as well, family friends that took your love for granted. That's like, man, I shouldn't have misled them. Man, I played over them. A lot of people are redoing the way they treated you, and a lot of people want to get back towards you, but your energy is different. This difference was needed. How you want to close it out? I keep hearing a person crying. You made this devil cry. This could, I heard this also could have been a devilish player that you made cry. Yep. People didn't expect for you to change. You changed up. 
Whatever you used to do in the past, you don't do that anymore. Not only do you not do it, you do not tolerate and allow the same things of the past. You have learned people's patterns. You've learned their systems. You've learned people so you know them, so you know the, their trickery. You will know the tree by the fruit that it bears. And if you see a devil, you just specifically call it a devil, a devil and you gracefully bow out. You got somebody here got a lot of people crying behind him. I hear a lot of people crying. And I even hear like, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. There's a lot of people that were devilish in your life. Yep, the in-between. See here, you're in that place where you're changing. You're not where you used to be, but you're not where you're going to be just yet. So you're progressing and people see that. And the thing is, people can see how bright your future is going to be without them. That's why these people are crying. And some people could have intentionally misled you. And some of you all, you need to know. The very thing that was done to you, this magic, is what's being done to them. I hear, uh, I saw that thing with um, Whoopi Goldberg, with Seeley. Yeah. The nervous breakdown they were praying for you to have is the nervous breakdown they're having. You operate from a place of wisdom. This is where you, you, you know, you really stood up for yourself. And you're not, you shouldn't be ashamed. I feel like some of y'all feel bad because people are going through things. But this is the work of their hand that's following them. Yep. Somebody here, get ready because you're going to fall in love. This is going to be new love, though. This could be an ex for some of you all that really regrets not loving you or not offering their love to you when they could have and should have because Venus is working on your behalf. Venus is getting ready to have a head-on collision with Jupiter, and you're getting ready to get a love, a love offer. Some of you all, this will be from a brand new person. Others of you, I do see an ex going to try out here one more time. And I hear that song, one more night. Just give me one more night after the rain. A lot of people are crying. And they owe you apologies. I keep hearing that. Yep. You can taste it. Um, clear system. There's something you're going to specifically taste. See, you're glowing and people recognize your glow and your difference. You're just standing out. Fifth house, I told you, don't go back. This is your time of peace, your time of pleasure. And here is a partner that's going to reward you. Somebody also, I'm sorry, I'm going to say this bluntly. This new person going to put this old person straight to shame. Get ready for this new home. Get ready for this new blessing. Get ready for this new relationship. You had to go through experiencing a bad relationship so that you could recognize and be able to identify a good one. You had to go through um, experiencing a bad person to be able to recognize a, a, a good one. And this is someone that you're going to be able to have fun with and live life with. This is a major breakthrough. That's why this person or these people are crying. Some of y'all, you have a lot of people crying, wishing they wouldn't have done certain things. They push you to the limit, I just heard. Peace and blessings, great day. Congratulations, namaste.